Hi, this is Chef Bachi, and today I have one of my best recipes ever. It looks beautiful too. I'm using some pico de gallo that I had left over at home because it's early in the morning. I add just like a quarter teaspoon of coconut oil and I also add the same amount of pico de gallo to water. Why? Because I want it to simmer and kind of brown a little bit without adding so much oil. Tidbit of pepper and that is it for now. We cover it and we cook it for two minutes. Once the two minutes have passed, the pico de gallo is going to be slightly cooked. Since it was already in lime juice, it doesn't completely cook at all. But look at those flavors in the mixture. They are amazing. You keep the crunch of the vegetables because it was already in the lime juice. It cooks beautiful. Look at that. This is what I like best of doing it with the pico de gallo. They don't become a sauce. They keep their form and texture. Now we're going to add a handful of black olives, sliced black olives. I love this mixture. It's amazing. Black olives and the tomatoes with that lime that they had from the day before. It's perfect. Now I'm adding an egg that is spreading out. So what we're going to do now is we are going to cover it for a little while. We still want that yolk that's a little runny, but we want to cover it so most of the white cooks through. If you want your yolk all completely cooked, then you cover it for just a little longer. Let's separate our egg from the pan and transfer it to our plate. Simple as this. Some pico de gallo left over, some leftover olives, and one egg. An amazing breakfast. We're gonna top it with my secret ricotta tapenade that I make. You can follow this recipe at the end and link to it because it's one recipe that I usually keep at hand for arepas or for people when they come over for many, many delicious dishes. And I can still use it in the morning with my eggs. I have one egg, then I add the ricotta tapenade which is basically some ricotta cheese with Greek yogurt and sun-dried tomatoes and olives. Check this out. It's a beautiful recipe and it's breakfast. Imagine having such an amazing breakfast in minutes. Shepachi. Scroll down for the recipe, you can print it.